I'm Anil Kumar and here is another example of writing repeated decimal numbers as rational numbers. Question is, write 0 0.567 recurring as a rational number. When I say 0 0.567 with a bar on top, it really means that the number 67 repeats. So let this be equal to x. We can write this as x equals to 0 0.5 that means six seven six I should write seven six seven six seven like this right so six seven repeats so let the rational number be x which represents this number in that case what will be thousand times x why am I writing thousand times x since I want six seven to be on the left side of decimal so when I multiply this by thousand the decimal moves three places, right? And what I get is 567.67. We I can write like this, repeating, right? That was for you to understand that it repeats. Now that is 1000 times x. Now if x is 0 0.567, then what is equal to 10 times x, 10 times x will be 5.6767, which I can write as 67 repeating. Do you see that? So what we got here is that after decimal, we have the repeating set, and that's the strategy. So you have to assume a rational number, and then multiply that by numbers so that you can get two set of equations and both after decimal we have to have the repeating set now if I do from it let this be my equation 1 this be equation 2 now if I take away that is 2 2 if I take away equation 2 from 1 what do I get so I get 1000 X minus 10 X right so 0 take away 0 is 0 then from 10 if I take away 1 I get 9 here I have 9. So 990x is on the left side is equal to 567.67 recurring take away 5.67 recurring. So after decimal I get 0, right? I get 0. 6767 recurring goes away. And on the left side 7 take away 5 is 2, 6 and 5. So we get 562.0. And from here, I can write x is equals to 562 divided by 990. Do you see that? So this is a rational number. I can always simplify this, correct? Now, I can divide this by 2, for example. So if I divide this by 2, so what I'm doing is I'm dividing both numerator and denominator by 2 so that I can write it in a simpler form. So it gives me 2 and 16 is 8 times 1 and denominator 2 times 4 is 8, 19, 2 times 9 is 18 and 5, right? So that becomes a rational number in simplified form. So I hope with this you understand how to write a recurring rational number recurring decimal as a rational number right so for you to practice what you can do is you can practice with numbers like 1.243 right so I'm repeating this let this be one and you can also try a similar to this 0 0.123 so remember first you should multiply by thousand right Assume this to be a number x, multiply by 1000 so that you get 123.23 recurring and then you have to take this number out. So you have to multiply by 10 and once you take away, you can get the rational number equivalent of the decimal repeating number. I hope with this you understand the concept. Let's move on. Thank you and all the best.